We have inhabited Earth for millions of years, but until today we still don't know everything about it. We may have advanced in many ways, but we still continue to search for knowledge, not only about things in the present, but also about our past. We continue to discover extinct and new life on our waters, and the frozen glaciers and permafrost are no exception to these discoveries. In fact, the melting ice is like a treasure trove of discoveries, carefully preserved by Earth itself for us to discover. From Utsi the Iceman to Ice Worms, here are 15 jaw-dropping discoveries found frozen in ice. Number 15. Utsi the Iceman Utsi is dubbed as the greatest thing man has ever found on ice. Also known as Utsi the Iceman, this mummy of a man was found in the Utstal Alps, hence the nickname Utsi back in September 1991. He was believed to have been alive during the Copper Age between 3350 to 3105 BC. More than 5,000 years ago, this man was believed to have been murdered due to the discovery of an arrowhead in his left shoulder and also because of the other wounds found in his body. Utsi is older than the Egyptian pyramids and Stonehenge. Back when he was alive, he was using stone tools and owned an innovative and very valuable copper axe. Thanks to the environment's natural preservation, Utsi was still in good shape when he was discovered. And even today, we can still see Utsi's leathery remains at the South Tyrol Museum of Archaeology in Bolzano, Italy, where he was kept in a devised cold cell to preserve him for future generations to see. Number 14. Yucca the Mammoth Yucca is the most well-preserved woolly mammoth carcass ever found. Seeing yucca sent the researchers more than 39,000 years back into the past. Yucca is estimatedly 39,000 years old, although in reality she died back when she was still a young mammoth. She was found along the Ayogos Yar coast, approximately 19 miles west of the mouth of the Kondratievo River in Siberia. The people who discovered yucca lived in the village called Yukagir, hence the mummy's name. After she was discovered, she was stored in a natural refrigerator, which is the local permafrost at Yukagir. Now why is this discovery so significant? It's because yucca is so well preserved that researchers discovered less damaged skin and even blood cells from yucca. Ancient species just like yucca carry very valuable information about how they adapted back then and how they went extinct. In fact, there has even been an attempt to clone yucca using the genetic information found in her well-preserved mummy. For a little fun fact, did you know that way back in 1984, a bunch of researchers in Alaska decided to cook up a piece of meat from a 50,000-year-old bison they found frozen in ice? Thankfully, no one was food poisoned after consuming the stew. But surely, no one reached out for a second bowl. Number 13. Giant Frozen Squid the waters of Antarctica may be freezing cold, but life finds a way everywhere on Earth. One morning in the remote Sea of Ross in Antarctica, a crew of fishermen hauled up a giant creature from the waters, a giant colossal squid that weighed 770 pounds. It's as long as a minibus, and it's one of the biggest creatures on the ocean, and one of the most elusive as well. Now this squid was left frozen for eight long months until they thawed it. The squid was so big that they needed a forklift to put her inside a tank. Just imagine how terrifying she would look while swimming in the water. However, even if the squid was caught, her remains still provided a lot of information for researchers and scientists. Her discovery also led to people actually believing the existence of the giant creatures. For so long, colossal squids were only labeled as fictional creatures, only existing in sailors' minds, until a couple of them were seen across our oceans. Today, we continue to discover a lot more of these gigantic creatures that lurk deep within our waters. Number 12. New Life You know, one of the most common tropes in movies is that researchers uncover something ancient in the ice, and once it thaws out, it will cause destruction to mankind. Well, just recently, scientists discovered ancient viruses in a Tibetan glacier. But don't worry, because according to researchers, they won't really cause humans any harm. In total, 33 viruses were found, and 28 of them are ancient pathogens that researchers have never seen before. According to the researchers, the glaciers where they got the microbe samples from are formed gradually, and through time, many viruses are deposited in the ice. The glacier where they got it from is called the Gilia Ice Cap, and it's located in a 22,000-foot summit in Tibet. Just think how much more ancient life is frozen on ice. Number 11. Lenbreen Tunic Aside from human and animal remains, 
Tools, weapons, and clothes are also valuable archaeological discoveries. Back in 2013, researchers found a tunic under melting snow in the Norwegian mountains. It was found in a place where people used to camp while hunting reindeers. The tunic was slightly bleached and discolored due to the sun and wind. And of course, it also showed hard wear and tear. According to researchers, the tunic was made between 230 and 390 AD. This tunic is quite special because only a handful have been discovered during this time period. The clothing revealed that our ancestors back then used fiber from lamb's wool or an adult sheep's wool to create their fabric. The Lenbreen tunic is actually quite simple as it had no buttons or other details. The tunic also served its purpose very well, as researchers theorized that the last person that wore the tunic may not even be its first owner. Number 10. Singing Ice Music is almost everywhere, to the point that it can even be heard in the frozen environment of Antarctica. The most curious thing about it is that the music comes from the ice itself. Scientists discovered that the Ross Ice Shelf in Antarctica is creating tones that are reminiscent of a didgeridoo, or a horror movie soundtrack. You would think that just like everything nature produces, the sound of ice would be beautiful, but it's a mixture of eerie and magical. The hums of the ice are played at a frequency that isn't readily audible to our ears, and they're only heard using a seismic sensor. Now this tone is like an actual song that tells us about the ice. The tone changes based on the snow dune's position and how quickly they're melting. Because of this, scientists can now use the hum of the ice to monitor the shifts in surface ice in real time. Furthermore, it will help them study the ice shelf stability and predict whether it's about to collapse. How cool is that? Number 9. Mammoth Tusks A few years ago, the discovery of a single mammoth tusk sparked a gold rush in the Arctic. The permafrost of the Arctic is slowly thawing, and the melting ice reveals a treasure trove of ancient things well preserved by the frigid environment. One of the things preserved by the ice are thousands of skeletal remains of the majestic mammoths that once roamed our planet. The tusks are one of the most priceless finds. These tusks are estimated to be at least 10,000 years old. It may just be an ordinary tusk, but once they're shipped to dealers, they can be sold for more than $30,000 each. Indeed, it is a very valuable relic. The frozen land in Siberia is thawing, and the villagers keep on finding rare and precious ancient relics that are preserved by the icy environment. The residents usually found the remains of a frozen mammoth, and the first thing they'd usually do is to gather it as carefully as possible and see whether they can sell it. The precious mammoth tusks are one of the most sought after, as they're even called the ice ivory. However, many people fear that this obsession may eventually endanger elephants once again because of the higher demand of their ivory tusks. Number 8. Ancient Mendenhall Forest The Mendenhall Glacier is located in Alaska, and for the past few decades, it's been slowly thawing. Recently, scientists discovered something beneath it, an ancient forest that is now exposed to the world for the first time in more than 1,000 years. Researchers have already noticed a few logs thawing from beneath the glacier, but as time went by, they started to notice more trees with a considerable number of them still standing upright. The Mendenhall Glacier is one of the most beautiful glaciers in Alaska, and this discovery just made it all the more precious and special. This ancient forest will surely give scientists more information about life in the past, especially about the trees that once flourished in the area before the glacier advanced. Today, the ice caves created by the melting ice is a glorious blue from the inside, and the trees surrounding it make it look like it's something out of a dream. If you have the chance to visit, then surely the Mendenhall Glacier is one of the most beautiful attractions you can find. Number 7. Shackleton Exploration Back in 1914, Sir Ernest Shackleton started his journey to explore Antarctica. Along with 10 men as his crew, he rode the ship Endurance in an expedition towards the South Pole. It was a treacherous and ambitious goal, and unfortunately, it didn't end well. Their adventure may have been incredible, but the fact is five of the crew lost their lives during the journey. Endurance sank in 1915 because of sea ice, and so Shackleton and his crew were forced to escape using small boats. For more than a hundred years, Endurance was one of the most sought after undiscovered wrecks until they found her at the bottom of the Weddell Sea. The ship is still in incredible condition, even though it's been dwelling at the bottom of the ocean at least 10,000 feet under for more than a century. Researchers were surprised to find it upright at the bottom of the seabed, just as if it was floating on the ocean. The discovery of this wreck was a very incredible achievement. 
Number 6. 100-Year-Old Notebook Many explorers really tried to find out things about Antarctica, and one of them is the explorer Robert Falcon Scott. He died back in 1912 while crossing the frozen continent, but his thoughts and story lives on through artifacts discovered after his passing. Part of his legacy is the century-old photographer's notebook found at one of Robert Falcon Scott's expedition bases in Antarctica. It belonged to one of his crew, which was believed to be a surgeon. It contained notes about the photos they captured during the exploration. However, after almost a hundred years on ice, the pages of the notebook are stuck together and the binding is dissolved. Researchers still tried their best to carefully separate each page and decipher its contents. The notebook's contents are digitally recorded and then the remnants are carefully put back together. The best thing is that just like its contents, the notebook was returned back to Antarctica after it was preserved and recorded. Number 5. Mysterious Objects Google Earth is one of the most fascinating websites you can find on the internet. It's a program that lets you see a 3D representation of the Earth, primarily based on satellite imagery. Now we all know that Antarctica is a frozen wasteland, bare and empty aside from the handful of creatures that survive in its freezing temperatures. However, a bunch of people spotted a few mysterious objects while they were exploring Antarctica on Google Earth. First is this elongated object that looks like a shuttle. It has a trail behind it, and it looked like it abruptly halted in the middle of the ground. Now there were two explanations for this image. According to the timestamp on Google Earth, this picture was taken back in 2011. Some people believe that the object may have been an aircraft that crashed into the nearby mountain. However, some experts also claim that this image is nothing more than a rock that slid through the ice from the summit. The second finding is this alleged UFO. The argument is also the same. Some claim that it's nothing but a rock, while others say that it was actually a spacecraft that crashed in Antarctica. A lone, weird-looking rock, for evidence of extraterrestrial life. We'll leave you to decide that for yourself. And now it's time for today's topic. Just take a look at this photo. There have been countless alleged UFO sightings in both the Arctic and Antarctic. It isn't really a secret that there are a lot of things hidden in the frozen environment of the Antarctic but normally they're just evidence of life that existed on our planet thousands of years ago. However, as some of the ice slowly thaws, people believe that it's possible that we just might see evidence of extraterrestrial life in the Antarctic. Then again, there are a lot of conspiracies surrounding Antarctica, from alien existence to secret facilities. Do you really think that we might find valuable evidence in Antarctica? As always, comment down below with the hashtag today's topic and let us know your opinion about what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Before we go on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take 5 seconds to complete. You just leave a like on this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now. And that's it. Try it. Number 4. Adelatl Darts a researcher was astounded to find an atlatl dart, which is a spear-like hunting weapon in a melting patch of ice high in the Rocky Mountains near Yellowstone National Park. According to researchers, the dart may have been frozen in ice for 10 millennia, and the warming temperatures and the melting ice is slowly showing us the secrets buried by time. We didn't really realize the potential to uncover precious and important archaeological materials in the melting permafrost until the early 2000s. The researchers certainly didn't expect to find an important artifact in small patches of ice, but the dart shows just how possible it is to find an ancient discovery anywhere around the globe. Number 3. 32,000-Year-Old Seeds Remember that one squirrel that chased an acorn in that kid's movie? Well, it seems like he actually existed during the Ice Age. Researchers found a seed in an ancient frozen squirrel nest in the Arctic buried 30 meters underground. Now that in itself is an amazing discovery. But now, experts tried to germinate the Ice Age seed, which was estimated to have been about 32,000 years ago. They're basically trying to resurrect the Ice Age seed. And they actually succeeded. The seed produced a small shite tundra flower, called Silene stenophylla, which is like an Ice Age version of a modern-day chickweed. These flowers grow and thrive in the driest tundras. This discovery and revival is one of the greatest breakthroughs we've had while researchers found things in the permafrost. Number 2. Jure Jure may be one of the oldest dogs in the world. While this little pup lived approximately 57,000 years ago, 
Her remains were discovered in July 2016 in the thawing permafrost near Dawson City, Yukon, Canada. Zhur is the most complete wolf mummy known even today, so much so that researchers can still examine the papillae on her lips, to her skin, and to her fur. Researchers theorized that Zhur died as a puppy when her den collapsed. She was only seven weeks old when she died, but the scientists concluded that she had an instantaneous death, so she didn't suffer for long. Because of the exceptional preservation of her remains, scientists were able to discover that Jur's kind lived through the fishes in the Klondike River. This showed us that during the Ice Age, wolves also relied heavily on aquatic resources instead of hunting oxen or bison. Number 1. Ice Worms Many of us think that worms are one of the simplest creatures on Earth, and we can't deny that a lot of us find them disgusting. Well, depending on how you see them, this might be good or bad news. But ice worms actually exist. These creatures are one of the few that survives in the lifeless glaciers. These worms live in western North America, where they're scattered throughout the glaciers in the Pacific Northwest, British Columbia, and Alaska. These tiny black worms emerge in summer to feed on algae and microbes, and retire to their burrow deep within the ice during the winter. These worms are actually seen as a paradox by scientists. You see, the laws of biology dictate that the lower the body temperature is, the slower our bodily reactions become, and the lower our energy levels drop. But then, these guys break that rule. Ice worms become more energetic as their bodies become colder. You see, their hobby of burrowing deep within may be similar, but ice worms are no earthworms. And so, scientists want to know more about these creatures, before their only habitat, the glaciers completely melt. What do you think of these discoveries? Do you know of any other jaw-dropping things that have been recently discovered in Antarctica or the Arctic? Let us know about your thoughts in the comments down below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.